Now the 2-0 to Gamboa, blooped in the right for a base hit. It's considered America's pastime. The Cyclones are a minor league baseball team. Based in Coney Island, these players have been drawing the crowds in their Brooklyn neighborhood for 12 years. Billy Hanna is the team's director of communications, and Twitter has become a huge part of his job. Twitter for me is kind of a, it's an everyday thing, it's an every hour thing, it's an every minute thing, it's always going on. So it's something that we have to monitor almost on a, on a minute by minute, hour by hour basis, particularly when we have games. When the games are being played here, Billy gets very busy. He tweets about the experience at the stadium and of course after every single score. But he also uses it to receive instant feedback from all the fans who are watching the game at this park here in Coney Island. Some businesses even pay for their ads to appear on users' timelines. Advertising accounts for more than 90% of Twitter's revenue, and it's more than doubled since last year. But the company has yet to turn a profit, so is all the hype worth it? For an advertiser, uh, Twitter's a pretty valuable proposition. And the upside for Twitter, uh, you know, the, the future value is that right now they're only making money from a small percentage of its user base. So going forward, as they start to monetize the rest of their users, there could be a lot of growth there. And Billy Hanna thinks Twitter is not just a fad. It's a tool that everybody uses. And unlike MySpace, where people kind of got over it when it got kind of too uh, commercialized, you know, Twitter and Facebook have both done great jobs of kind of letting it be what it is. And for businesses, it's a great way to see your, your clients, your fan base. Uh, I think because of that, I mean, it, I think Twitter and social media, it's only going to get bigger. It's not going to go away anytime soon. But that's only if the fans continue to follow Billy's tweets. The site thrives on its popularity, and there's evidence of slower user growth. What Twitter needs is not a home run, but many regular hits. Marie Corey, BBC News, Coney Island, Brooklyn.